Hey, what's up? This is Brian Pfeiffer with SurrealNightlife.com. I'm standing here behind the building that is uh, the actually home to the Deja Vu Showgirls. And you can see kind of behind me, I got the, the pink neon love boutique sign here. Uh, I, it's, it's late at night here, so I wanted to make sure I catch some light. So I'm <laughs> short, sort of filming in the back alley here. But uh, there's a light right in front of me, so I'm not uh, totally darked out. But uh, there's a little bit of neon, so you might see some pink and uh, purple uh, neon going on here behind me. But let's talk about the uh, Deja Vu Showgirls. And... Uh, uh, what's going on with this place and a little bit more about it how you can get in get the packages and whatnot so uh, you guys can come and experience uh, the deja vu kind of the famous deja vu showgirls if you guys don't know the deja vu showgirls in las vegas is also um, run by the people that run the hustler club in vegas and they also run little darlings okay and then they have several other strip clubs around um the country. I know they have another Deja Vu in Chicago and I think several other locations. They also just uh, reopened the El uh, Nerfino. It's called, it's the old seamless space over here across the street from the Orleans off Arville and uh, that just opened up too. So that's going to be like a Latin nightclub, strip club type of thing. And then right here, it's funny, I got a train coming. <laughs> the, the one time I'm filming, I got a train coming in the background here. So we're going to get the train. Uh, I'm probably going to have to uh, pause the video here while the train goes by and we get the, uh, the sound of the train in the video so all right so the train has passed and I can finish the video uh, so let's talk about deja vu showgirls I think this at one time used to be a topless club but it's or I mean a full new club without alcohol but now they've changed it over to a topless club um, and so they do serve alcohol they do have a full bar inside. Um, we have a, do have several different packages, ones for couples, uh, larger groups, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And then we also have a two drink ride and entry special that we're working on. And they do have their own fleet of cars. You'll see some cabs driving behind me here, but uh, you definitely don't want to take a cab if you're heading to any of the strip clubs. And, uh, there's a little photo bomb. So we have a ton of different packages and whatnot with Deja Vu. Uh, very reasonably priced, okay? Out of all the strip clubs in Vegas, I think the best package deals as far as price goes is here at Deja Vu. Um, and it's, it's popping on the weekends. I do notice that a lot of my uh, Latin clientele likes this particular venue. Uh, it's a... Um, you know, it's not like a Latin strip club per se, but I think they do play a little bit of Latin music. They do play a little bit of hip hop, um, a little bit of top 40. And uh, it, se it seems like it gears a little bit toward the uh, the Latin clientele a little bit, okay? They do have several vehicles. Um, you can't really see it too well from here, but back in that corner, there's a party bus. I know that's one of their vehicles. I think they have several Escalades and whatnot. So um, when you call us up, we're gonna send a vehicle from the strip club. The driver will have your name and number and they're gonna pick you up in the vehicle from the strip club, okay? If you take a cab or an Uber or a limo, uh, these guys are gonna lie to you and they're gonna tell you, oh yeah, we're gonna take you to the strip club. And what they do is they take you to the strip club, they get paid out by the strip club. So what ends up happening, instead of getting two drinks, a ride and entry uh, for 40 bucks, like our deal, okay, you're gonna end up paying for the ride, which ends up being, you know, 10, 15, 20 bucks, whatever it is. And then they're gonna charge you like 50 at the door because they kick that 50 back to the limo drivers, the cab drivers, and the Uber and Lyft drivers. So you definitely don't want to uh, to do that, go that route. Make sure you call me, I'll send a car from the, or send a vehicle from the strip club with a strip club logo on it and they'll pick up that goes for any strip club in las vegas okay now as far as the girls go here um you know it, it's not going to be like your top here strip club you know rhino's right across the street over here sapphires is right down the street over here so you're competing with the big dogs uh with them but they're definitely more of like a you know kind of like a b type list strip club they have a good amount of girls here on the floor on the weekends i would say probably anywhere from 50 to 75 during the uh the weekends and then maybe on the weekend the weekdays probably somewhere around 20 to 30 girls on the floor for. Uh, but they do have some good specials during the week, just so you guys know. Uh, they have like dollar beers during Monday Night Football I saw on their sign when I was driving in. I know they have this $2 Tuesday promotion that's a real popular promotion with the locals because it's $2 drinks and whatnot. So um, definitely a good place to come check out. Um, it's not super expensive here. The drinks are a little bit more reasonably priced and you're going to find it like a Crazy Horse or a Sapphire or Rhino. Um, but you know, you're not going to get that top tier talent. Uh, most of the like top tier girls are going to work at those type of places where there's bigger clients and bigger money. But uh, this is definitely one of the kind of the mid-level type places and you can come and get a nice drink and have some you know nice views and get a reasonably priced lap dance or a private room and uh, that's what you'll find here at deja vu so if you guys have any questions i'm going to put my cell phone up above 773-459-8133 uh, make sure you like this video if you enjoyed the content and uh, bang the notifications bell uh, for more content i got coming soon and i do appreciate all the support on the channel i'm brian pfeiffer signing out for uh, deja vu show girls here in las vegas we'll talk to you soon bye